Om Shanti. This is the Avyakt Murli of 2nd of November, 1987. And the title is The Basis of Transformation is Realization with an Honest Heart. Today, the world transformer, the world benefactor, Bab Dada, is seeing his loving and cooperative and world transformer children. Through self-transformation, each one is engaged in service of world transformation. Everyone has the same zeal and enthusiasm in their mind that they have to transform this world. And they also have the faith that transformation is to take place. That is, it can be said that transformation is already guaranteed. You have just become Bab Dada's cooperative, easy yogi children in name and are making your present and future elevated. Today, Bab Dada was looking at the world transformer instrument children and was especially looking at one thing. All the instruments for the one task. Everyone's aim is self-transformation and world transformation. And yet, while being instruments for self-transformation and world transformation, why does it become number-wise? Some children bring about self-transformation very easily and quickly, whereas others have the thought of transformation one moment, but their own sense scars, the situations that come through Maya or the elements or the karmic accounts that are to be settled through the Brahmin family, weaken the elevated enthusiasm for transformation. Then there are some children who are weak in having the courage to bring about transformation. Where there is no courage, there is no zeal and enthusiasm. And without self-transformation, there isn't the success you would like to have in the task of world transformation. Because this alokic godly service is the proof of three types of service at the same time, what are those three types of service that takes place at the same time? One, attitude. Two, vibrations. And three, words. All three instrument, humility and altruism are powerful on the basis of this. For this is how you achieve the success you would like to have. Otherwise, service takes place and you please yourself and others for a short time due to some success in service, but there isn't the success that you would truly like to have and which Bab Dada wants. Bab Dada also becomes pleased that the children have happiness. However, the result according to your capacity, is definitely noted in the heart of the comforter of hearts. He will definitely say, well done, well done. Because the father's vision and attitude of blessings for every child is always there. That if not today, then tomorrow, these children will definitely become embodiments of success. However, together with being the bestower of blessings, he's also the teacher, and this is why he draws your attention to the future. So, 
Today, Bob Dada was seeing the result of the task of world transformation and of the world transformer children. There is growth. The sound is spreading everywhere and the curtain of revelation has begun to open. The desire is now being created in all souls everywhere that they should definitely come close and have a look. Whatever they had heard has now been transformed into wanting to see. All of this transformation is taking place. Nevertheless, according to the drama, what is visible now is the result of the powerful impact of the father and some elevated instrument souls. If the majority were to attain success with this method, then all Brahmins would very soon be revealed as embodiments of success. Bhav Dada was seen that the basis of success, self-transformation, that would be liked by yourself, by people, and by the Father, is lacking at the moment. Why is there a lack of self-transformation? The main basis of this is that one particular power is missing. That special power is the power of realization. The easy basis of any transformation is the power of realization. Until you have the power of realization, you cannot have experience and until you have experience, the foundation of the specialty of Brahman life cannot become strong. Bring your Brahman life from the beginning in front of you. The first transformation. I am a soul and the father is mine. And what basis did this transformation take place? It was when you realized, yes, I am a soul, and this one alone is my father. This realization enabled you to have an experience. For only then does transformation take place. Until you realize this, you continue to move along at an ordinary speed. But the moment the power of realization makes you experienced, you become an intense effort maker. In the same way, all the particular things about transformation, whether it is about the creator or creation, until you realize every aspect that yes, this is that time, this is that same yoga, and I am that elevated soul. You will not have that same zeal and enthusiasm in your activity. In some, there will be transformation for a short time due to the impact of the atmosphere, but it will not be for all time. The power of realization brings about easy transformation for all time. In the same way, in self-transformation too, Unless you have the power of realization, there cannot be elevated transformation for all time. In this, realization of two things in particular is needed. One, the realization of your own weaknesses. Two, the realization of the situation, the desires and feelings in the mind of the one who becomes the instrument. For that situation, the weakness of a person or of that one stage from being under an external influence. By knowing the reason for the test through that situation, let there be the realization of passing in that with your elevated form. 
I am elevated. My stage is elevated and that situation is just a paper. This realization will easily bring about transformation and you will pass. The realization of the desires of others and the realization for their self-progress is the basis of your self-progress. So, self-transformation cannot take place without the power of realization. In this too, one is realization with an honest heart and the other is realization in a clever way because you have become very knowledgeable. So, in considering the time and in order to justify your task and glorify your name, you will have realization at that time. But that realization won't have the power to bring about transformation. So, realization from the heart enables you to receive blessings from the comforter of hearts, whereas the realization with cleverness will make you and others happy for a short time. The third type of realization is that your mind accepts that something is not right. Your conscious also tells you that this is not right. But in order to prove yourself externally to be a Maharati or because of not wanting to make your name look weak or any less in the family, you continue to kill your conscience. To kill your conscience in this way is also a sin. Just as committing suicide is a great sin, so too this also accumulates in the account of sin. This is why Bab Dada continues to smile and also continues to listen to the dialogues in their minds. They are very beautiful dialogues. The main thing is that those who have this type of realization think, what does anyone else know? This continues to happen. However, the father knows about every leaf. He doesn't know about something only when he is told about it, but even while knowing about it, he becomes ignorant and with innocence, with his innocent form, he makes the children move. Since he knows, why does he become innocent? Because he is the merciful father, and so that you don't accumulate further sin in that sin. He has mercy. Do you understand? Such children become very clever and come in front of the clever father or the instrument souls. This is why the father becomes merciful and the innocent Lord. Pap Dada has a very clear account of the actions and every thought in the mind of every child. There is no need to know what is in their hearts, but the image of each heartbeat of every child's heart is clear. This is why he says that he doesn't know what is in each one's heart because there is no need to know it. It is already clear. The chart of the heartbeat of every moment and every thought in the mind is in front of Bab Dada. He can tell you about it. It isn't that he cannot tell you about it. He can tell you the date, place, time, and exactly what you did. He can tell you everything. However, while knowing all of that, he remains ignorant. So, today Baba saw the whole chart. The reason for self-transformation not taking place at a fast speed 
is the lack of realization with an honest heart. The power of realization can give you very sweet experiences. You understand this, do you not? Sometimes consider yourself to be a soul who is the jewel of the Father's eyes. That is, realize yourself to be the elevated point merged in the eyes. Only the point can merge in the eyes. The body cannot merge in the eyes. Sometimes, consider yourself to be the jewel of the forehead, sparkling on the forehead. Sometimes, realize yourself to be a sparkling star. Sometimes, experience and realize yourself to be Father Brahma's cooperative right hand. Brahma's arms in the corporeal Brahmin form. Sometimes, realize yourself to be the avyak angelic form. With the power of realization, have many unique alokic experiences. Do not just speak about them in the form of knowledge, but realize them. Increase the power of this realization and then the realization of the other type of weaknesses will automatically become very clear. Even a tiny spot would very clearly be seen in a powerful mirror and you would be able to transform it. So, do you understand? The power of realization is the basis of self-transformation. Use the powers. Do not just count them and be happy with that thinking. Yes, I have this power and I also have this power, but constantly use them for the self, for others, and for service in every task. Do you understand? Some children ask, does the father do just this all the time? But what can the father do? He has to take you with him. Since he has to take you with him, he needs to have such companions. Therefore, he continues to look at you and continues to give you the news so that you companions become equal. It isn't even a question of those who are going to follow behind. There will be many of them, but the companions have to be equal. So, are you the companions or those who are part of the procession? The procession will be very big. This is why the procession of Shiva is very well known. There will be a variety of those in the procession, but the companions have to be like this, like the father. Acha, this is the eastern zone. What is the eastern zone doing? Where will you make the sun of revelation rise? That the father incarnates is now something old? However, what will you do now? You have very good intoxication that this is the old kingdom, Brahma Baba's original place, Calcutta. But what will you do now? Now, the sun of some newness rise so that it emerges from everyone's lips that the sun of newness has risen in the eastern zone. Now, demonstrate this in a practical way by carrying out a task that no one else has yet done. You have had functions, seminars, served IPs, and also served through the newspapers, but everyone does that. So now, show some sparkles of newness. Do you understand? The Father's home is your home. You have arrived here comfortably. Comfort 
of the heart also gives you physical comfort. When there isn't comfort of the heart, then although all the facilities for comfort are available, you feel uncomfortable. You have comfort of the heart. That is, Rama is always in your heart with you. And this is why you experience comfort in any situation. You have comfort, do you not? Or does coming and going make you restless? Nevertheless, consider it to be the destiny of the sweet drama. You are celebrating the Mela, are you not? To meet the father, to meet the family, to celebrate the Mela is also sweet destiny. Acha? To all the most powerful, elevated souls, to all the intense, effort-making souls who use every power at the right time, to all the happy-hearted children who always achieve the success they want in service through self-transformation, to the embodiments of success who always remain clear with an honest heart in front of the Father, the Comforter of Hearts, Bob Dada's love, and remembrance from the heart, and Namaste. At the time of taking leave, speaking to senior brothers and sisters, Bob Dada wants to make all the children fly with pure wishes for making them equal. The instrument servers are definitely going to become equal to the father. No matter how, the father has to make you that because he will not take just anyone with him. The father has his pride too. If the father is complete, but the companions are crippled or handicapped, it would not be fitting. The crippled and the handicapped will be those who are part of the procession. They will not be companions. This is why the procession of Shiva has always been shown as those who are crippled and handicapped because some weak souls will become worthy after passing through the land of Dharamraj. Blessing, may you always be an embodiment of success with the experience of being a companion and a detached observer. The children who always stay with the father automatically become detached observers because the father himself plays his part as the detached observer. So those who stay with him will also play their parts as detached observers and those whose companion is the Almighty Authority Father, automatically become images of success. On the path of devotion, they call out, asking for an experience for a short time to get a glimpse, whereas you have become companions in all relationships. Therefore, stay in the happiness and intoxication that you have attained what you wanted to. Slogan, the sign of waste thoughts is that your mind is unhappy and your happiness disappears. Om Shanti.